Expectations were high for South Gwinnett linebacker Reggie Carter when he stepped on the field last year as a junior, but it would all come to an abrupt end after tearing his ACL during the first game of the season. Rehab was tough. It was more mental than anything. I had great players on my team that would encourage me to go. It'd be days I wouldn't want to go and they encouraged me to go. And then, you know, they'll have me push, push myself and we'll come out here on the weekends and we'll just work. Facing the reality of being sidelined for an entire year, Carter decided to take on a new role with the team and work on the mental aspect of his game. You know, it's tough watching it from the sidelines, but then the coaches, they gave me a play call sheet, so I helped the um, scout team. I'll be Coach Carter, and I, I helped the scout team, and we'll run the plays and stuff. It helped me learn the scheme more, I'll say. By doing all that, it helped me understand more of why we did this and why not do this, but it helped me understand the scheme a lot. Despite the severity of his injury, it didn't slow down the recruiting process as Carter remained a top target for the nation's elite football programs. I don't think Reggie is, is close to 100% yet of what he's going to be. I think, you know, this year, next, next year, this time, I think he's going to be a totally different ball player. Reggie worked extremely hard to get himself healthy again and come back. and. I think a lot of colleges took notice of that too, his work ethic, what he does in the classroom, what he did on the field, and knew that he'd be able to bounce back and get his health again in his knee. When it came time to make his college decision, Carter chose to remain in-state and attend the University of Georgia. Well, I think he's going to be a, a great football player. He, he, number one, he's a great student. He's going to take care of his academics. He's a kid with all the intangibles you look for in a football player, student athlete. Uh, he's a leader. He has character. He has integrity. Uh, he's going to go over there and, and, and work his butt off for them. Oh, Georgia felt like home. I mean, every time I go up there, I, I like the coaches and I like the atmosphere. And then going there on game days and these game visits, it just adds more to it. It just felt like home.